be the glory. Um, we're Unit E, we're from Gainesville, Florida. We've had the opportunity to uh, dance in Israel the last two years, and the Lord's really blessed us with um, a group of young people that has really committed themselves to the Lord. Um, and so what I'd like to share with you right now is a story, and it's a story behind what you're going to see. A few years ago, about 25 Israeli men and women were held hostage in Jerusalem by Palestinian terrorists, and one by one they were shot. But one man left a legacy on a small piece of paper, and it was found by the IDF a day later, and it was immediately composed into a song. It was a cry to the God of Israel to hear their plea and send help as the heart and soul scream in silence to the Lord. That is this song that you're about to see us do. Every year thousands of American young people turn 18 and they go to college in peace and quiet, but this is not the case in Israel. Instead, thousands of young Israelis are given M16s and taught to defend their God-given land at all costs, even death. They still believe and hope that peace will come to the land of their forefathers, but through all of the pain and darkness, God's promises still shine forth, as he says in Psalm 121, that he that watches over Israel never sleeps, no, but he watches over everyone. God has not forsaken Israel, and he will avenge her. As you see this battle scene, think of the young IDF soldiers. And remember that even though the enemy tries to kill and destroy God's people, he sends his ministering angels to restore, revive, raise from the dead, and keep burning his remnant in this generation. Remember to pray for the peace of Jerusalem, for you will prosper that love her. For God will bless everyone who blesses her. This afternoon, we dedicate this dance as body worship and warfare to the Lord on behalf of the nation of Israel as she defends herself and her God-given inheritance.
Amen. 